Alrighty guys, uh, here we go with Franbo again, picking up right where we left off last time. Uh, we just got done taking the pretty little red pills and um, we went down the stairs and we saw Aunt Grace talking to Dr. Dern. Um, that's about it. I remember picking up these, these band-aids. Um, I did not examine them. Tiny patches to cure wounds. Oh, never mind then. Nothing to really examine. I didn't examine the box. It's open. Oh, okay. A little box. It's open. Can we... Oh, a key. Well, certainly... Okay. So we got a key. Awesome. Um, you know, I really like the design on this paper. I like the little skull and the monster and the little Franbo's eyes. It's pretty cool. I gotta say, it's pretty cool. All right, so the nurse went this way to um, go get a hook for the curtains. And I have a feeling she went in this door. So we're gonna go in this door. Oh, it's locked. We knew that already though, didn't we? Okay. I don't know. Um, You think I'm supposed to take the pills, like, in another room to see if something else opens? Let's take them in here. Oh god, poor Phil. Phil, what happened? Why are you looking at me like that? You're terrifying me. You terrify me. Yeah, who's this guy? Phil is playing with his uncle, and the uncle is mad, mad. Oh my god. We got this uh, buckle here. Oh. Hello. Oh no. Your head. Oh, shucks. Oh, yeah, we already. You can see. Alright, we're gonna try and open this door. What? I don't know. Um. Maybe I can use the key. The door. The key is too tiny. Such a tiny little key, too tiny to fit in this door. Alright, let's, um... Oh my god. Check out this beautiful lady right here. You're looking lovely today. Did you do something to your hair? Oh, it's all... I didn't click that. <laughs> I meant the nurse. Hello, Miss Nurse. Are you alright? Eh, yeah, she's fine. She looks fine. Hello. Huh. Okay, this guy, he looks friendly. Let's go talk to him. Get out, creepy creature. What are you, huh? Tell me. You like to see me sad? Oh, Fran. Oh. Oh, let's check out his mouth. You got a little blood on your mouth. Are you okay? My mommy also had blood in her mouth. She looks sad. Oof. Right. I looked out here, right? Oh, well this one's not so bad. It's not boarded up or anything. Nothing's happening. Ah, oh, the playground. Good night, trees. Moon. I'm pretty sure the playground is not a good escape route. Probably not. I really don't know where to go. Maybe I gotta go back to my bed. Oh no, Foxy Fox, don't cry. Use my hand as a tissue. Would you like a hug? Why are you so sad? Oh my gosh. Even the cat looks weird. What's going on? Oh, it's a sad face. I thought it was like blush for the cheeks and like a collar or something. Um, I don't think the pills are it. Maybe I use the hook with the door. The shape isn't right. I don't know. How do I get out of here?
Phil. Phil, tell me how you got here. Did you find the doctor's code yet? It's in the office. Yeah, I was there. But now my bed's blocking the way. Are you sure I can use this key? Are you sure? The key is too tiny. It's too tiny of a key. Hmm. I don't want to. I just woke up. I don't... Okay. Oh, wait. Maybe the tiny key goes to my nightstand. Ah! <laughs> What's inside? Um, uh, let's examine that. I gotta say, for such a lovely fami family, Fran is uh, quite an interesting looking girl. Um, what else did I pick up? A bobby pin, that's right. My hair clip, I should give it good use. Let's, let's try and use the hair pin on the store. Maybe that'll work. It fits, but there are two holes. I need something else. Oh, the shape is not, wait, hold on. Can I combine them? Huh. I don't know. There's gotta be something else I'm missing. Uh mm, Can I take the can I just take this? I read that. Violent trauma can have a great impact on children, totally changing their normal lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe Deficits and some abilities such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe in the world. This can be interpreted as paranoia. Alright. Can I just take the spoon? I really don't know how to get out of here. Alright, hold on. There's gotta be something I am missing with the pills. Right? I clicked on that, I clicked on that guy, I clicked on that, I clicked on that, I clicked on that, and I clicked on that. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Oh, okay. So I'll combine that with that. Combine it. Yes. Come on. Yes. Look at that. Okay. My very own special key. Okay. Let's not take those pills right now. Creepy, creepy voices let's bring in my ear. Okay. So let's use the store. Yes, to happiness. To happiness. Let's go. All right. So we came out of the store. We had the stairs. W C. I hear something. Like the megaphone or something. It's a maze. The maze. We never get to play there. Whoa! Tonight the fog is pretty thick. Yeah, it looks pretty thick. I wish I could get lost in there. Let's go in the store. Oh, okay. More kids. It looks like it's just her, though, because I can't go to, like, any of the sides. Okay, um, let's look at your toys. Oh, let me see. A red puppet and a serpent. A teddy bear and many other things. Snuggle, snuggle, old lady on your chair. There's no old lady there. And your booty will be flat like your face. Okay. <laughs> Flat faced booty. Okay, we have Adelaide. 
It's Delaria Fugens, age seven, female. The agent was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person, which almost killed her. This event has created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. The doctor has become has come close to the patient through drawing therapy. She's making progress. That's awesome. Rock on. Making progress. That's all. That's what it's all about. This bed is very pink. It's very very pink. Oh yes, real flowers. They smell so sweet. Look at this clown picture. Oh, this is one of those mute clowns. Like a mime. Like a mime. Okay, let's talk to her. Hello. You see them. You do, right? I don't. See you later. <laughs> Crazy. No. What? What? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? I see those shadows. I see those. Uh huh. I can't see them, but I know they are there. You know what they are? Do you know what they are? Yeah, I guess. Well, tell me, please. You like to draw? I love to draw. Hey, don't change the subject. We were talking about something very serious. I love it too. Yes. Tell me more about the shadows. Crayon, a crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. What are you drawing? Something? Well, what is it? My dreams. Go now. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, I guess let's do the red pills. Get ready for this madness. Ooh. Where did the clown go? Tiny, tiny hands all over you, eating your soul. Oh, Fran, you got a little evil there. Jesus. Even the purest of things die in this place. You should blame yourself, be quiet. He takes away your innocent inner child and devours it. Yeah, he looks disgusting. He looks like something you find in like the deep, dark oceans. I miss that. What did that say? You should blame yourself. Nobody believes you, although the wounds are bleeding. Aw, oh, that's kind of sad. Why do you look like a fabric doll? What have they done to you? Please, somebody tell me something. Well, this looks like a great fun. Oh my god, that clown is laughing. Freaking creepy. Ooh, let's go to the chair. <laughs> this chair. The chair, right here. I guess I can't click on the chair, huh? I think it's everything. Let's leave. This freaking place is creepy. Go. Um, let's take the pills in here. Let's see what it does. Oh, Daddy was not there. Mommy would not care. Hmm. It doesn't look like I can really do anything in this room. But that guy is he's scary. Alright, let's check out the WC room. Huh. Nothing in there. The throne is empty. I didn't realize anyone could see me pooping. Gross. I can and will hold it. Yes. Always gotta check to see if the mirrors are two ways or not. It's like this. The king likes drawings. Oh, the king likes drawings. Okay. Uh, let's not look in there anymore. Um, oh, crap. I've been caught. Huh, there you are. You should be in your room. The door was closed. Well, I opened it with my key. I opened it with my fantastic key. What key? Give it to me. It's gone. Don't have it anymore. Don't have it anymore. Don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. That nurse, she's not a nice lady. Ugh, I have no time for this. I have to find my way out. Oh, I'm back in this effing room. Oh, look, it's the doctor. Did you break out of from your room? That's not nice, Fran. 
I haven't eaten in days. I'm hungry, so I haven't eaten in days. I won't listen to any of your excuses, young lady. That's not fair. She really hasn't eaten in days. She's only had water. Let me go eat something. Sir, please, let me just go out and eat something. You have to learn how to listen to those in charge. Listen learnt. Of course, sir. Just don't do it again, Fran. Go and eat now, then get back to bed. Alright. Oh, that wasn't... Let's just go down the stairs now. Not listen to the nurse. What's this? There's an old man. Sir Oswald Harrison, a bearded old man. This gate is very locked. It's not just regular locked, it's very locked. The yellow door, that is my way out. I wonder what that blinking light is for. The sign shows where things are in the hospital. The reception room, you always find a nurse in there. I can smile and bow and tell the nurse to open the gate. I don't think that would work. Then again, He'd really think I'm insane. Probably, friend. Sorry. Huh. What's in here? Hey, get your hands off the office door. I shut your face. Take your face and shut it. I can't reach those tiny windows. Those are tiny. Let's talk to this guy. Sir, the key hanging up there. Can I have it? Sure, I could give you the key if you give me a kiss. Gross. Ugh. Ugh, you should kiss your butt. What a bastard, you can kiss your butt. Oh, I guess he uh, didn't care that I said that. If I call emergency, I don't think they would help me. No, probably not. Oh. Is your back itch? Hello, are you alright? What is that supposed to mean? I just wanted to know if you feel okay. I don't want to tell. The doctor will cut your head open if you don't leave. Ooh. He likes to eat brains. He already took mine. He ate all of my thoughts. He ate your brain? Well, it is full of protein. He will eat yours too. I saw you inside the doctor's office. You were dead. Oh no, then I have to go. I hope you find new thoughts. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Good luck on finding some thoughts. That sucks. Oh, here we go. There's another kid's room. Isabel. She won't wake up. I guess this means she's heavily sedated. I wanna be sedated. Would you like to have me escape? With your big muscles and hairy arms, you can break through every wall. Oh, that's so optimistic. Good night, shiny toys. Good night. Have you seen my kitty? They probably haven't. Elephant, sir, you are very pink and soft. You look like you haven't been training at this. Oh, you look like you have been training at the circus. Clowns on the walls in the house of madness. Yeah, there are a lot of clowns everywhere. Your tiny hat is very sweet. Hello, what are you doing? It doesn't work. The paper is not working. Yeah, what do you mean? You don't need a paper with TV. The paper should be working like they told me. Who told you that? They told me to tell myself they told me to tell myself to do this. Paper vision. They told you to tell yourself. Here, let me help you. Paper vision. <laughs> Can I help you with something? The waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. Alright. Ooh, cupcakes. How's that? Did it work? We are losing the waves. Change the channel. What about this one? Still not working. Paper vision negative. Change again. Okay. Human testing approved. Patrick Hyatt. He looks creepy as all heck. Look at his eyes. There's no soul in those eyes. How's this one? 
We are losing the waves. Change the channel. What about this one? It says kill Monday. The TV. Kill Monday. Just kill it. The waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. Jesus Christ, which channel? What about this one? We are losing the waves. Change. Okay. The ant? Is it the ant? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This sounds scary, like some white noise stuff. It works, it works, a miracle. Thank you. Paper vision positive. Great, can I see it? I mean, I spent all that time helping you. No, this is mine. If you want, you can take the papers that didn't work. All right, I suppose I can use the papers to write or draw on. I'm busy. Paper vision in action. Paper revision in action. Okay. Little paper boat taking to the sea and beyond. The action men. Could either of you help me find my kitty? Oh, look at that. Mine now! <laughs> All right, let's take my pills in there. Or right in here. Oh my god, he's really, Oh my god. He was really freaking out. I could see why. That must have been really uncomfortable for him. Look at me. I say I care while... Wait, look at me. I say you're beautiful while you eat poison to eat. Look at me. I say I love you while I am teaching you to hate yourself. Look at me. I say I care while you're dying of hunger and thirst. Is he talking about the TV? Is that like saying... The TV says you care, but it's really poisoning you. Wake up, Isabel. It's touching you. It says that you're gonna die soon. Are you afraid of death? I hope not, because it may happen, even if you don't like it. Black shadow. All the clowns disappear when I go into pill mode. All right. Mm. Let's leave. Just got his head back. Let's take him in here. Gosh. Teddy, what are you doing here? Are you on your way to meet another Teddy? Say hello for me when you get there. Oh my gosh. What about this guy? This guy looks... Oh. I will laugh at you. I will lie to you. I will hide you inside the shadows. I will laugh at you. That doesn't sound pleasant at all. Alright, so I guess that's where I get some food. Alright, I won't mess with the food just yet. Wait, where are you going? Where are you going? You don't look happy at all. Alright. I think this is where she was. And he loves to drink milk like a kitten. Sadly, she's not my cat. I'm going to miss her. I guess she won't remember me. I can just go out the door, right? This door's always locked at night. I can't go out and play. Let's look at the window. Eh, it's still the playground. Um, let's check out this food. I don't want this. I'm not hungry. You just said you were hungry, but you hadn't eaten. You literally haven't eaten in days. Don't disturb me. Go away. I'm eating. Don't touch my sword! No, it was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I am your king. I bow to you, sir. Very well, my child. What is the purpose of your visit? I want your cane. You're his sword. What walking cane? Do you mean my sword? Yes, your highness. Your sword. What would you give me in exchange? Anything you need. Your Highness. Bring me a castle and a horse. Only then will I grant you my sword. A castle and a horse. Oh, there she is. She just went to go sit down, that's all. She's really freaking out. Hey, Annie, how are you? Are you afraid of me? You no, know, you look like you're afraid. No, why would I? Because I can do magical tricks and make you sleepy. Wow, I didn't know you 
could show me. Show you, but it's very scary. It's better if you do it. I'm not a magician. I can't. I can give you the magical stuff. Really? Woohoo! Yes, the magical stuff that will make anyone fall asleep. That's amazing. Powerful and grand. Here, as a gift, take it slowly. Ooh, she gave me a pilly pill. A pink and blue one. How does it work? Well, we know how it works. It's a pill. I have no idea. Huh. Okay. See you later, Annie. Annie, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Mr. Midnight, are you here? Your cat is not here, dude. I don't like this painting. Probably is staring at you. Mommy loves to paint roses. What do we have here? Chocolate. Mmm, yummy. I don't like bitter coffee. Alright, let's see if we can eat. Mmm, I can see some of the milk tea in my mouth. Ooh. Lemonade? A little lemonade. I'm not that thirsty. Does this bring some? I wonder if that pasta was cooked today and not by the look of it. My grandfather clock is big and grand. Hello. Well, hello, friend. How are you today? <laughs> I see dead animals, miss. But other than that, I'm doing just fine. You mean in the television? No. For real. Just forget it. Very well, friend. Go play with your friends now. Oh, yeah, let's just, you know, brush that shock off of our shoulders. You see dead animals? That's all right, friend. Oh, there's Annie. Annie! Annie, you're okay. Are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? She is not okay. Annie? Not okay. Oh, I didn't take the pills. Hold on. I didn't take the pills here. I didn't see. I didn't see if I could do anything here with the bus. Oh, because he's a pig. Reach the key. Yeah, I gotta get the key. Uh, Mr. Pig is naked. More like skinned. He has no wings to fly with. Wonder what part of the body that is. Ew, a crunchy pig's head ready to be served. Hmm. I wonder who would eat this. I think my kitty would be afraid of it. Anybody with, you know, normal sense of reality. Oh my gosh. This place is super blurry. It's like going in and out of focus. Oh, this clock sounds odd. It feels like it's whispering right into my ear. Whispering the time. It's two o'clock. Hello up there, miss. Your dress is very pretty. My mother had a very pretty dress, too. What's that? A bleeding clock. Looks like time is broken and stopped. That's probably how it really is on the bills. What's up here? Oh, yeah. Okay. Um. The phone's ringing. Alright, I gotta get the key. Gotta get the key. Gotta get the key. Feels like a chilly breeze of sadness through this fence. This breeze feels like sadness. Um, no. Oh, wait, wait, Annie's actually going down here. Where are you going, Annie? Annie. Oh, she's really not doing okay. Ugh. Oh, okay. Well, it's not like she does anything. Um, I really don't know what to do next now. The signal is weird. What do I have here? Oh, um, I got a hook. String band aids. Okay, I have an idea. 
Um, where was the little girl with the crayons? She was through here, right? Phone's always ringing when I'm walking by. Hello! How do you do? Alright, I think this is the door with the crayon girl. Yes, talk to me again. Crayon, crayon, I left your jaw with that crayon. That's my, my crayons. Can I have it? I just like this green crayon so much. Can I have it? No, I won't be able to draw green then. That's ridiculous. Yeah, Fran, how's she supposed to draw trees? But you have so many. Yes, many colors, but you know, they don't like me drawing. Who? Who? The nurses, they tie me up, and when I want to draw, I can't. It's so messed up. They are crazy. They're the ones that should be in this institution. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk look. Prepare yourself. Whoosh. Please cure me, yes, and stop the red milk. Let's see what I can do. I think I can give her the band-aids. Uh-huh. What a friendly gesture. Oh, thank you. You can have the crayon. Now I have to draw. Okay. Cool, I got a crayon. And then I think I can... Do I have the papers? Oh, wait. Did I never grab papers from... That paper vision kid? Do I have to walk? Okay. I, never, I think I have to grab the papers that the paper vision kid um, gave me. But I don't think I actually, like, grabbed them. Da, 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 da. Okay, paper vision positive. Paper vision positive. Okay. Aha, yes, here we go, papers. Now I can write our draw when I'm bored. Alright, I think I can combine the papers with the combine with the crayon. Oh, I draw something special for the king. Okay, so I can give this to the kid with the cane. So I can use the cane and the hook to reach the keys. I'm guessing that's what's gonna happen. Yeah, I'm thinking. All right, so I'm gonna stop this here. Um, definitely playing some more. This game is really creepy and pretty sick. <laughs> but uh, I like the creepiness. Um, I hope it doesn't uh, get too scary. <laughs> he is really watching that. Wow, he is intent. All right, well, thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll see you later. Thanks.